Family Day is a day off school. Doesn't mean uh, there's no time for a little bit of science. Here with a few easy experiments you can try at home with the kids, it's Dan Riskin. <laughs> and Dan Riskin, in addition to you, we've got some budding scientists. We've got mm. Elliot, Nico, Madeline, Charlotte, and Marion. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. I feel like we got a lot of science around us right now. Yeah, it's it's a big day for us. It, but you know, kids ask questions better than adults do, so I think true. we're in good hands. That's one thing. I feel like kids ask questions. Yeah. I didn't particularly grow out of that stage, uh -huh. but it's something that's all about curiosity. It totally is, and that's the beauty. I'll tell you the truth. The three things we're going to do today, yeah. I've never done. Oh, really? And I picked them because that's what you want to do. If you've done it before and you're trying to do it again, it's not really science. Now it's engineering. You're yeah. just trying to tweak it, yeah. right? <laughs> Science is where you're like, I don't know if this is going to work. Yeah. And so I don't know if these are going to work. Ooh. I'm a little bit nervous. Okay. Um, but that's what you want to do. When you're taking your kids into a world of science, yeah. if you're doing it with them, mm -hmm. that's just much more authentic. So it's let's true. do this. Trying something new. That's what I love about the kitchen, too. You're always yeah. trying something new, learning something new. We're going to start off with a our first science experiment. But we're going to ask uh, my friend Elliot to come on up here. How's it sound, Elliot? Elliot. All right. Okay, Elliot, thank you so much. A very cool sweatshirt, Elliot. I love a dinosaur. You're welcome. Do you like dinosaurs? No. No? <laughs> no, but you like, you like a raptor, right? Mm, yeah. Yeah, raptors. But not really. But not really? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. What a fun fact about you. What, did you get, did somebody make you wear that sweater yeah. against your will? Did you? Mom. Your mom. Your mom. Oh, my oh, mom. gosh. Classic mom. Always making them wear a dinosaur sweater. Oh, my it's goodness. The worst. All right, Elliot, we are going to do an experiment today. Dan, what are we doing? Well, we're going to try to suck an egg. Okay. <laughs> And, but instead of doing that ourselves, we're gonna have this bottle do it. And okay. so this this is a hard-boiled egg. Did mm -hmm. you feel that, please? Kind of squishy. Has it got a shell? Yeah. Does it? It does it have a shell? No. 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 Okay. No, do you like a hard-boiled egg, Elliot? No. No. Yeah, well this that's why we're gonna do this yes, instead. Yeah. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna put on safety glasses so Me I can too. be just like you, just okay. to be safe. And uh, it's always important to be safe. What we're gonna try to do is get this egg to go down into the jar. Now, like I said, I've never done this. It does not go in if you try this way. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna use some physics to do it. Okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna light this piece of paper on fire. Okay, we're gonna be careful. We're gonna get our parents to help. Yeah, you want or a friends, responsible adult Dan. or me if yes. that's what you can do. <laughs> you want a responsible adult, they're gonna light this on fire. We're gonna put it in there and it's gonna heat the air up. And okay. once the air heats up, it's gonna be expanded. Okay. But then once the fire goes out, it's gonna cool down and it's gonna start to suck the air back in. Oh. And so that's when you, my friend, are going to put this egg on top. Are you ready? Don't do it yet. Yeah, we gotta wait, we gotta wait. So Dan's gonna, we're gonna stand back because this is happening. Oh, I hope I can do this right. Lighting a fire, not getting burned. No, not getting burned, very yeah. tricky. Okay, yeah. we're going in, yeah. we're going in. Yeah. Go to your home. Go to your home. There we go, there, there we go. Okay, good. Okay. Good, good. And as soon as it goes out, great. Can you put the egg on top, top, please? <gasps> what? It's Elliot, happening. Are you Come seeing on. this? Do it. Go. Are you seeing? Oh, is it gonna go? Give it a little push. Just give, give it a, a poke. Little. Give it a poke. Give nice. This. One more poke. One. Coming up. Yes, and we've we got do. Nico and Marion coming up. So come on up, guys. Nico and Marion. Oh. All right. All right. So All what right. are we doing, Dan? This one, we are. We, this is pepper. Yes, it is pepper. And we're gonna put a little bit of water in this dish. Okay. I'll do this. Okay. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a magic trick, and so. I'm gonna spread this pepper all across the water and we're gonna see if you have magic in your fingers. Okay. Okay? Okay. So let's try, just sprinkle this on here. See, the pepper's all spread out all over the place. Isn't now. That cool? Okay. Nico? Do we like pepper? I don't. No. I, don't. I feel like I'm going to sneeze. Yeah. Do you like water? Yes. Okay, yes. Well, yeah, Good answer. That. Yeah. Okay. So, Nico, you are going to just touch the middle of this, and we're going to see if you have magic powers in your fingers, okay? okay. And I, I bet you don't, but you're our control subject. So, go ahead and touch that and see if anything happens. Okay. Nothing. Nothing really well, isn't happened. that interesting? Okay, Do interesting. you have magic powers? Nico, that was a really good job. Yeah. No, thank you. This is the magic sauce. A little bit of dish soap is going to affect the surface tension of that water. There you go. Did you get, is your finger a little bit soapy now? Yeah. Yeah, okay. okay. But don't tell people that when you show the magic trick for real. Yeah, no. And now, do you have magic powers? Do you want to touch the water? Um, Wait, we need a magic word. Yeah, what's the magic word going to be? Mm. Cool. Cat power. Cat, Cat power. power. <laughs> Cat power. Oh! There you go. The ran away! Whoa. Oh. 
I love how it's repelling. So this is like the perfect example of why science is beautiful. I have watched people do this on YouTube and it goes out yeah. to the sides. Ours did not. Yes. Why? Why? Right? And so this is where the day starts. Yeah. Is you get the pepper, you get the water, and you go to town. Yeah. <laughs> trying to figure out how you can make it look like it does. Yeah. Because we've learned something here. Mm -hmm. When it doesn't go the way you expect, that's a good thing. Yeah. So that's the beauty of science is you can't really mess it oh up. Oh my gosh, Nico, Marion, you are both wizards in my books. Congratulations. <laughs> Great job. Cat power. Great job. Great job, guys. Thanks, Thanks guys. so much. All right, we got one more final. Uh, experiment, and we're going to bring up Charlotte and Madeline. Come on up, you two. Hello. Charlotte okay. and Madeline. I am very excited. Dan, first off, do we like science? Yes. Yes. Love science. Great. Fantastic. Yes. Dan, what are we doing? Uh, I also like science. Yes, me too. Asking. Same, yeah. same thing. Okay. Yeah. So what we have is some, what we're going to do is make something called elephant toothpaste. Mm -hmm. And it's only called that. If you have an elephant at home, this is not actually toothpaste okay. for your don't, elephant. Don't, do you have an elephant? No. No. Okay, okay, got it. If you get one, you have to promise not to use this on their teeth. Yeah. Promise. <laughs> okay. All right, good. Okay, glad we were clear. So what we're going to do is we're going to take, this is hydrogen peroxide, and it wants to be water. Mm -hmm. And so we're going to use some chemistry to make that happen. But the very first thing we're going to do is mm -hmm. mix up a little bit of yeast mm. and water together. So can I get you, there we go, can I get you to put a tablespoon of, so of the these? yeast into that dish? We'll do it. Yeah. Oh, you know what's up. I don't got to help. Charlotte knows what's up. She knows how to measure. Nicely done. Good. That's and a good then we're going to put three tablespoons of warm, almost hot water in there with it. So basically, right now, this is where we get into kind of baking. This is why I love baking because it's kind of chemistry, two, right? Okay. We got one. one. We got two. two. Three. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. That's Good okay. Night. We got, you know what? Exact science, is it? I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Science isn't an exact yeah. science. Okay, go ahead and mix okay. that with a fork. And mix a lot. So I have been playing around with this, and I think the trick is to give the yeast a little bit of time to work their magic. Okay. Now, this looks like water, but mm -hmm. it's it's not H2O. It's it's mostly H2O and a little bit of H2O2. Okay. Hydrogen peroxide, mm -hmm. which just comes in, it's the stuff you put on your owies. Yeah. And that H2O2, can you keep mixing that? Because the more it's mixed, the red, like no lumps, like totally ready to go. Nicely done, nicely done. When this wants to be H2O, mm -hmm. it can happen quickly. And this yeast has an enzyme that can help it along. Okay. So what we're gonna do, can I get you to pour that into this container for me? Let's Thank do you. do it, perfect. Nicely done. Everybody's doing a great job. Fantastic Good. science. Again, I've never done this. Okay. I've only ever seen this. Okay. We're gonna put I've a also little... seen it a lot. In oh, a super cool. Okay, we got an expert. We got Charlotte knows okay, what's up. Well, good. You know better, more about it than I do. That's yeah. perfect. And I think we wanted to add a little bit of color, but you got to pick the right color. I, was I don't say, know. Do we have, now, which color do I think we should do? What color do you think? Two, um, two? Maybe yellow. Maybe yellow. Okay. okay. Let's do oh, yellow. Okay. All right. Can you add a drop of the yellow into yeah, the? Yeah, I'll continue mixing them. Nicely oh, done. Drop. Great. Nicely perfect. done. Yeah. Nicely done. And we'll give that a little bit of a mix. A little something. Okay. Yeah, there we go. This is looking good. Oh, this yeah, is looking, looking good. good. Okay, so now, this is the moment of truth. Mm -hmm. There's all this hydrogen peroxide that wants to be water. Let's see if we can do it. Can we take the clean funnel, please? That, I think, is the, clean, is the funnel. clean funnel. Yes. This is, again, good Dan, thing I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm here. Are you ready? Yeah, you <laughs> You're going to pour it in. Okay. Fast. And we'll see what happens. going to go fast. You're scared. Yeah, Me I too. Know. I'm scared. Go, go, go. Dump, 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 dump. Oh, wow, wow, He's chilling. I love it so much. You guys are such yeah. excellent Still scientists going. here. This is going to make a mess. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Is right. No, I got to say, for more great science from Dan, check out his free weekly email newsletter I just signed up. Just go to followthebatsignal.com to sign up. Y'all did such a great job. But just in case you at home or you in the audience want to celebrate Family Day a little differently, thanks to Looking Glass Adventures, you're all getting a free pass for two to Walden's Wizarding Shop, where magic and mystery await. And that's not all. Thanks to Explore games. You're also getting two excellent card games. That's not a hat and Claro. Enjoy. Uh, <laughs> Y'all did such a good job. We got some cleaning up to do. Amazing work. Dan, a pleasure as per usual. I love it. Hey, Mary here. What did you think? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more of the good stuff.